But I was she's searching for um self-defense. Guess what she was doing? And then she deleted she deleted the text where she said go um go kill him. The brother said y'all are um the brother had a text and said that y'all um that he's a dead man walking. Like you already know what you send a text out, that's it. But still, if he um, like I said, if he if he, if he seen the gun, <clears throat> if he seen the gun, but he ran back into the house, he shouldn't have, he shouldn't have ran back out with his gun. He should have ran the house, got his gun. Or like, like, we said, his mama says don't go or something like that. No, his mom was telling him no. Like his mom basically was like trying to tell him, basically like what any other mama would tell their child, like don't run out there. Right. He should have called nine one one. Right. So so him going back out there escalated the problem where. No, but the thing is, they came to jump him though. They just they uh, came to they, kill him. They did. The but... girlfriend told them to shoot the shoot his shit up. That's what the girlfriend texts her brother that he that need to go over there and shoot the shit up. So when she said that, okay, if you like, if you have a sister, and your sister say, hey, this dude, that hit me, he didn't body slam me, he didn't blah blah blah. blah it's always blah, it's always women. Whatever. Always women. Whatever. But anyways, he should he should have stayed in and um. He should have stayed in and just called the police, locked the door, kicked the girl out. But how how you gonna call the police when four other dudes is jumping his brother? His brother is on the ground getting jumped and stoned. So I, you said, me, I, I just said there's no, a car. I, you listen, said there's in the car. Listen to what I'm saying. Hold on, I need it. I gotta I gotta read up on this because you said that he they no, was in the car. Listen to what I said. He got the charge because the four boys was in the car driving off and he was shooting. In the road, you could see on his um brain cam where he was shooting. Okay, so the thing is, is that while he was shooting, he can he went back in to get his gun because four dudes were stumping on his brother. Oh, what? Well, he should win that there. I ain't say it. He should win that. So you telling me that you're gonna sit there and lock the door and be like, hey, nine one one, no, no, I no. just got jumped by four dudes. Oh, and my baby brother outside getting his ass kicked right now. No, like no. you gonna do that or you <laughs> no, gonna go back outside? I'm gonna go get, get I'm gonna ready to get my gun. Or worst, 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 case, worst case scenario, we both get jumped. <laughs> we are fighting, huh? I ain't gonna have time to go ready to get a gun. And my mom, at least, at least the it's the mama fault. She should have took her butt in there and um. You should have took a button there and, and got and got the gun. The brother, nah. the brother getting stomped on. <laughs> so he went there. You're so wrong. <laughs> the reason why I'm, I'm not laughing because the thing is, is that I never try to put myself in situations like that. That's why when I feel like things are escalating, I don't want to be in a situation. That's why I be ready to go. And that's the hints that you don't be getting. Like, I be ready to go. I'm going to get some some. There we go. Uh, we'll continue this conversation some, some more. Yep. Are you saying what? The husband wanted to jail for what? For robbery. And assault charges. Mm hmm. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Somebody's talking about some. Um, and her husband in the newspaper for robbery. LOL. Wow. She must have left him because he didn't have any money. Didn't give her any money. Nah. What's your take on it? Travis Rudolph been found not guilty. What all? What all you you from here to say? What all what? What all you from here to say? Um, nothing. I, you, you, you say using bacteria over here. Why? Because it's already hard being black. Period. And then with you being a male, they already label you label you as something. And with him, um. With people lying about what happened, like you gonna tell the girl telling her brother to go shoot his shit up, but then she's saying no, don't. I'm I'm not saying shoot him. I'm not saying shoot um the mom or the brother. But you literally told this. You literally told your brother that this man that came, like you was at his house and he just attack you like i don't know too many guys they will listen to their sister or their brother say hey yo somebody just did something to me like 
You think they're going to be calm about it? Like, if my sister come tell me that somebody did something to her, like, you better believe I'm all ten toes down about it. And I understand her brother jumping up and defending his sister. And there's nothing wrong with what he did. The problem is, is that all the evidence show, even his mother, Travis, mother was trying to show them what the sister did. The sister was punching him and doing all of this stuff. So it ain't the first time that apparently they, apparently she hit him or whatever. Because, I mean, from the trial, it seemed like he um, just get hit or allow her to just hit him. Well, not allow her to hit him, but he's he's been raised enough to know not to hit a woman. Hold on. Hold on. The, the girl named what, Dominique or something like that? Yeah. Now, who who is the sister you talking about? I'm talking about Dominique. Why are you saying sister? I'm talking about the boy. Okay, Dominique sent her brother to her brother go to trial uh, uh, to her, Travis House. Her brother and the, the other boys. Yeah, they go to Travis House and they and they they jump Travis brother. No, they jump. They try to jump Travis and his brother. His brother getting beat up, and he Travis Travis will get the gun and start shooting at him. Yeah. Okay. But they was in the car, and the problem the problem is everything he's found not guilty. But what I do realize is that um, looking back on it, the people that were supposed to be fighting for the guy who is dead, like they didn't act like they even wanted to be in court. So the guy, the guy that got killed was it her brother or, or no? Or, it oh, was, it, somebody else. It according to it, it's a friend, but oh, you know how you buddy. have a homeboy that's been with you like for years, and he ended up just being called a brother, like he ended up being called yeah. a son, you yeah. know, to your mother because y'all done been friends so long. Yeah, like this, that um, that's what happened. But how it go? If I was that guy, um, mother sitting in that courtroom waiting for another guy to be guilty and find all this evidence, like, I would, for one, I would be more upset with the ones who I came in that courtroom with praying and asking God to find this guy guilty because my child is dead and because he decided to shoot. Like you to kill my son, but at yeah, the same but, time, like, yo, yo, your son and his friends that came to jump me and my brother. Yeah, but it ain't. But the problem is, is you ain't looking at the picture though. The thing is, this mother is grieving. This family is grieving because they literally just lost a family member. This woman then lost her son. I don't, I'm not even sure if his family was in that courtroom, but if they were, I'm pretty sure that. Um, in this case, they were fighting for um, justice for the um, the boy. I I can't remember his name, but I'm pretty sure they was fighting for him. But the problem is, is that the ones that had the opportunity to fight for him, they sat up in court like they didn't care. They sat up in court like they didn't want to be a part of it. They sat up there like they like whatever. Like, if you are in court, you need not only if you have the attitude, you need to wipe that away while you're standing in front of lawyers and people and the jury and a judge. Like, they had an attitude. I feel like the ones that their family came in with, with the son who got killed, I would be embarrassed as hell. I would be so upset with each and every one of them. Now, you talking about the um, not the boy family that 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 the one not the one that's on trial. No, you you talking about the you talk about the girl, her family, or the or the other families, or the, or the other boy that was in the car. The one of the boys that was in the car that got killed that night. Yeah, his family was like they was all calm and peaceful and whatnot. No, what I'm saying is the boy that was in the car that got killed. The friend. The friend. Okay, the friend that had got killed. I'm saying if I was his family member or his mother that was sitting in trial, 
with the ones that he was in the car with, they couldn't even, they act like they couldn't even sit up straight. I understand that one of the dudes that got shot in his hip or whatever and sitting for a long time might be really hard for him. But it's the fact that he had an attitude the whole entire time. Like, you're not even trying to say, like, even though all of them was in the wrong for going to that man's house, you still ain't going to sit up there like you're trying to defend yourself. Like, he ain't even trying to defend himself. He's just like, it's whatever. Yeah, it's whatever. I don't care. He calling the um, lawyer Mike by his first name and saying, it's whatever you want to do. It's it's on you, like... At this point, I'm just going to agree to everything you say so it can move, make the process faster. Like, what the hell? They would have had to move my ass out the damn courtroom. Because I would have said, that's my goddamn child. Really, girl? Yes, really. Because I'm telling you, if you are a friend of my child, and you are in the place where you can send somebody to life in prison or 12 years and you sitting up there talking about some years whatever it's whatever you want to do Cause it, yeah you right they but know it but they could they could have been the mindset of we know what we did so let me just it's whatever because if i say anything about it then but how, how you get out the, the, the rain camera called everything no the the rain camera called. i wonder how you got off when all the boys was standing in front of the porch on the porch, or they were standing like in the yard, I'll say, because it don't look like from the camera it doesn't look like it's a big um porch or whatever. Yeah. But they all standing in the yard. You can see where one of them um either uh they pressed the um doorbell. You can see where one of them knocked. And you also can see where Travis' brother walked outside and said, Hey, yo, you know, what's up? Like, this, that's part of the videos that I've seen. And after I've seen those videos, I've seen that video and I've seen a video where Dominique was charging at him. She was hitting him in the face. And I've seen where Travis was ducking. Oh, and the, i also seen a video. Oh, the girl that they tried to fight, too. No. You said Dominique was targeting him. Dominique was hitting him. This went all, like, the first thing that you seen was when she was punching him. Because it looked like they was coming coming back from somewhere. And you could see where um, he was trying to either open the door with a key or he was just opening the door, period. However it goes, you could tell that at that time it was nighttime. Yeah. So, either he said something to her and she started punching him. Like, she kept looking like she was jumping up trying to punch him in his face. And he was, like, ducking. So, when he went in the house, like, it looked like that part, um, either she bent down or he bent down and she bent down and kept hitting him. But after that, that video cut off. I ain't see nothing else. Then, you see another video where a couple of guys start coming up to his house, ringing the doorbell, knocking on the door. And then you see his... Baby brother come outside. Like, hey, yo, what's up? And then another video, you see where Travis is running with his gun and he fall. But you see lights, like, come on and off or something like that in the video. But to make long story short, everybody picked up on Travis' side and Dominique's side and everybody wrong. But I really feel like it was never a proper way that people said, you know what, rest in peace to the person who lost his life over the dumb decisions of his friends. But it almost seemed like if I'm your friend and um, we brothers and you telling me, hey, somebody didn't hit your sister like, and your sister just had surgery, yeah, I'm going to come help you. I ain't, I ain't saying I'm gonna come kill somebody, but yeah, they they need to be they need to get a little beat up or whatever, and call it a night. Right. But as far as bringing weapons and all that other stuff, I ain't down for that. What? That's, I feel bad. They should have jump. They should. They should have tried to jump him. Yeah, but I feel bad for the guy 
because now he's not here to defend himself. Then it's Florida. Stay in your ground, so. Yeah. So that's why I say I really feel bad for that family who had to sit up in there and watch all of that and still grieve after they still continue to call the guy name. Well, one of them, I think one of the judge, you know, said, um, he said something about, you know, restoring or something in between lines of that. Like, he did say, um, the person wasn't there. So, it was almost like he wasn't there in the courtroom, of course, but maybe his family was there. I'm not sure. That's one of the questions that I do have. Like, was his family even there? Ain't no telling. But it's that it's a sad situation. <sighs> like just every like hell break loose over one female. Which they should, man. Like I was, like did you that, that tweet I see you did you check on it like the, the people people were saying about it? I can, I don't have Twitter. Oh, let me see. I'm hearing people saying like they should like they should find a way to sue like you probably can't sue her for criminal charges. They do, but he oh look at that. Here's a video of uh, Travis Rudolph praying with his family and friends shortly after the jury went into the de- de- deliberation room. Like he, they got they got everything right here. Have ago, I, um, like, 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 look, look, somebody tweeted, arrest Dominique. She clearly tampered with evidence. She's clear. She clearly said that she do her, said that she do her research, and it took her eight days to come in and say that to say that to the detective. So she clearly seen she could get in trouble for it. So she made up some side story eight days later before they found out. Wow. Yeah, and the reason of it is because she deleted her texts, and she um the boys threw their guns. They passed the hospital to throw a gun out, and this boy in the back seat fighting for his life. Somebody said, "Is it too late to? Is it too late for Dominique to be arrested?" Somebody said, "It's up to the state, but he can take her to civil court." Like really? But the problem is, is that I ain't gonna lie, like, just say if I was in that car thinking somebody that got shot, the first thing I'm gonna try to do is take them to the hospital. The second thing I'm gonna do is tell everybody in the car to get out. If I'm driving, I'm gonna tell everybody to get out and say that I'm finna go park the car. Instead of me going to park the car, I'm finna go find ways to hide this gun until we get out of the hospital. So I'm gonna come back to the hospital and then see by my friends, see by everybody else. But as far as me, just what's wrong now? Boy who died? Cause they the reason why they in court was because of the boy. Let me see. Here's a here's a highlight for the thing. Let's see, Rudolph claimed the four men, like over to say their name, came to his house around midnight on April 7th. That just happened over a month ago. Wait, no, 2021. Yeah. Hold on. Well, he been the whole time in jail? Huh? Well, he been the whole time in jail? Yeah. Two years. 2020. No one ain't never heard of this. 2021? I thought this happened last month. But really? I'm dead serious. I'm when you have court, <laughs> some things don't go like stuff like this. They have to find evidence, but like it ain't gonna take no. Like you, you, day. you told me like this a couple of weeks ago. I, I didn't know this happened two years ago. To to physically hurt or kill him, Ted measures it included including to the evidence by Rudolph attorney showed that Rudolph ex girlfriend Dominique Jones sent Ted measures to her brother, and to. Kanisha Jones and Tyler Robertson telling them to go shoot up Rudolph House re- reportedly because Rudolph had been with another woman. Oh. 
What? You tell your brother and your and his friend to come shoot up my house because I've been with another woman, and you and you married out here. Wait, she married, wasn't she? Yes, she was married at the time. Man, they better find a way to get her arrested. What the, the what the heck? I ain't, no, I, ain't, I ain't no none of this. From my understanding of him, respectfully of what he said, I can tell that his mama raised him and her son's right. And the reason of it is because in court, this is what he said. He told Dominique that they're not together. He wanted to you know, start off just being friends and going on dates, see how things go out with each other. And that's respectfully a romantic type of guy. And probably- Dominique was rushing for him to be in a relationship with her. But in my mind, I'm pretty sure Travis kind of sort of knew like something was off about this girl. Because if you and this girl, y'all friends and she having surgery getting stuff done for her body and you out here trying to become the next nfl or whatever like he was trying to focus on himself and i truly respect him to tell her i'm trying to work on myself he might not have said it in that way but he said it enough for her to know like hey i'm i'm working on myself I think we should be friends because he never knew where his career was going to lead him. Right. And then on top of that, for her, we don't even know her situation. We know she's in real estate. I mean, a realtor. So we know that she sell houses for a living. Okay. That's what she do. So you get a hit and miss. We know all of this stuff about her, but I don't know if she just was like, hey, I've been seeing him on the news because Travis is the guy who was on the news at one point about him sitting at lunch with this autistic boy that was sitting off to the side by himself while everybody else was in the group. Travis decided to get lunch and sit with the boy and eat lunch with him. So they became best friends. So they was already talking to Travis because Travis was already on fields and training and doing all this other stuff. So I don't know if Dominique just came in his life because she felt like his career was about to take off. And he was about to be making some money. And she was about to be a good, you know, rich girlfriend or sure. whatever. And the thing is, is that she already knew that Travis, um, he basically, the money wasn't coming in for him. So she, she's already a type of female that expect expensive stuff. And he admit on trial that he did buy her expensive stuff from here and there wherever but here's the kicker this girl that did all this and if you sitting on trial for someone who you basically say let's just take things slow and after you tell her that not only that, you find you a friend, another friend, because that's what he did. It doesn't say that he's in a relationship with the girl that, that she found texting his phone. It doesn't say none of that. He never said that that was his girlfriend, none of that. He, he never did. He said Dominique was his girlfriend. Dominique said on court that they were dating. And it's, just, it's two different ways that you can come out to the world as you're dating you could come out to the world as y'all boyfriends and girlfriends you could come out to the world as y'all just y'all just friends but y'all just testing waters right with each other and from her with her view she's his girlfriend in his view she's just a friend so he she's but she's just a friend that can keep company into whatever you know to whatever the decision that's been made on them being together 
But <laughs> the thing is, is that I really hated for him because when she was away for her search and she was at home that whole time, if I was Travis, I would have kind of put things with her. Because before her surgery, if y'all already got into a physical um, situation before, it would have been a perfect time for you to just say, you know what, hey, you know, all is well to you and go on about your life. All right. <clears throat> and you wouldn't be sitting in court with her. Okay. But you can, how he, how Travis speak and... How he held himself in court, I can tell that his mama raised both of her sons. I don't know how many other children she got, but I know they raised them kids. They she raised them boys right because both of them, not one time did either one of them have an attitude on the court. On the court stand, neither one of them was disrespectful. They answered the questions. They said what they had to say, and it was over with. But yeah. Well, for all in all, that man is that man is free. For somehow, some way, y'all gonna pay me back for these two years I've spent in jail, though. Right. So one way or another, y'all gonna pay me back for this. Ma'am, sorry for your son. Like, but it ain't no and but like. No, 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 no. Oh, I, I just said sorry. He sorry, gone. sorry, no, he ain't gonna sorry, for, sorry. He ain't gonna never get that back. Ma no. Ma'am, sorry for your son. Things happen, like, I don't want to be like, I say like things happen, but, hey, it was my life, your life, I'm protecting myself, et cetera, et cetera. I guess it's safe to say you were trying to be a, not a hero, but trying to be a brother at the wrong time. I think I would have, with me being their friend, I would have just said, hey, let's just let things cool down for the night. It's, it's, it's like, it's, it's, it's stupid. You, it's you, late you, or you, early in the morning. You, your, your, your sister, t like, I see if, you, if she texts you saying he'd have put hands on me right now, something like that. But she texts him saying that he with another woman. He went with another woman. No, but, okay, but that would have texted saying something about he with another woman. So yeah, you, you tell her, you tell the so, Sister takes her brother and say he was another woman so I need I need y'all to go shoot him shoot, shoot his house up. Really? Yeah, like, like, like these are that, dudes. That, 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 guys that, are really quick to that serious? Like, be talking to you and if, somebody else and they but, mama too. But think about it. If the brother and the friend knew better, they they were looking at like, okay, he was another woman, just they, they, they break up with him, leave him. We're not gonna go shoot him up and risk our lives for for the cause when they when they shot him up, they didn't kill him, but they still shot him up. That's attempted murder. Bam. They still going for a long time. Or they, or they did shoot him up and killed him. Bam. You going forever. Come on mm -hmm. now. Y'all stupid. I mean, she's your sister and all that stuff. But no, nah, I don't listen to your sister um, saying something like that. Go shoot him up. That's why I say they really should have just listened to what she said. Let things calm down. Think and about respectfully it, right? went over to his house. I or, or not even went to his house. I wouldn't do that because they give him the right to stay on your ground. Yeah. Take my property. Like, I just That's why I'm there. saying, not even went to would've, his house. It would have been me call calling or, him. Okay, yeah, call or text. Or just saying, hey, look, I just need me and you. We finna go to Chuck E. Cheese or no, CC's no, or somewhere. We gonna sit down and, you know, have a talk. No, not that day. Cause people shooting up ki more kids. That, no, not now. Uh -uh. People crazy. I'm just saying, somewhere, like, he could have did it in a different way. We ain't gotta talk. I said, you, we ain't gotta talk. I tell, I tell my sister, leave him alone. Don't go back over there, all that. But no, but see, I, ain't, I, ain't, I ain't gotta talk to him unless he put hands on her. Then we got a problem. But did he put hands on her? But that's what I'm saying. That's what the sister told him. That's what the sister told the brother that he did. No, not, no, I just read it said that he told her that he was another woman. Is it number no, no, putting hands no, on her? Uh 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 uh. You, that's why I said you need to look at the trial. No, now, if, you put, if you put hands on, that's a different case. But still, it's it's still no. it's still the state of Florida. <laughs> She told, I think at some point she told him that he slammed her on the ground. Like, did, did, everything was said in trial. That's why I said you need to go watch that trial. Oh, uh, that's crazy. She said all of it, the, like, they said all this stuff, and then she talking about some, um, 
Yeah, when I said go shoot your shit up, I didn't mean him. Like, man, if I tell you to go shoot some shit up, I mean everything. Even you included, even the baby and the dog and the cat and the rat and the roaches and the. I don't care. Shoot everything up. Now we're doing all that. I'm just saying. That's what it means to me. I don't know what that means to you. I'm I'm just saying. Too much. <laughs> but no. Yeah, that's crazy. But I'm happy that he's a free man. He deserved to be free. And um pray that um Like I said, two not two years, somebody paid me something. I'm getting something back. I get my whole way. my whole life my whole like he playing for the CFL so he was to make a little money my whole football career probably over with too. Come on now, I'm suing her. Civil like I said, civil suit get what I can like like time what is it like wages lost or something like that something. Well, I think with him, um, from the looks of it, um, he's with a prayed up family so I I believe that if he don't go back and try to get um Dominique uh in jail for everything that she did I really feel like I wouldn't even, I, fact, I wouldn't even bother with I wouldn't even bother with trying to put her in jail I didn't leave her alone like I that's what I'm saying I do think you. he either he gonna leave her alone and work it really focus on himself and whoever the girl is that he was texting maybe he'll leave her alone too maybe he'll actually find a different person i seen people look crazy i seen one i seen one tweet said to my i guess he now that he out he'll leave them black women alone then just talk to latinos and white women well if he do <laughs> if he do it don't matter who he decides how to long as that person they ain't putting him back in a situation like that like, nobody got time for that. It's like, just like I said, it's all really hard for you to be a black man. And then on top of that, being black and being um, labeled as something that you're not. That's crazy. Well, that's anything else you want to talk about while we still recording for now? Anything else in the news you want to talk about? Mm-hmm. That crazy, <laughs> oh, we were talking earlier. That crazy, what that them crazy, them crazy clothes Kanye West wearing. <laughs> it's probably too late. It, it, it's probably too late to re talk about it, but that, that, that nah. Uh-uh. She must, he must be giving her a lot of money for her to be at, be, be dressing that way and acting that way. Who, Kanye? The girl, but yeah, Kanye. Probably. Ain't no telling, but from my understanding, I thought they said he was broke. Man, I mean, he said he ain't worth, he ain't worth supposedly whatever he was worth for four to six billion, but he's still probably up. Let me see. Let's let look at what's what's Kanye West net worth. Five hundred million. He's still up. I mean, he he ain't Kim Kardashian though. Kim Kardashian, um, she's like a billion dollars up. Hmm. Kim Kardashian is like a like a, a billion dollars up. It's different between five hundred million and one billion. Or well, one point two billion. All right, well, that's the end of this. We gave y'all a good thirty minutes. That'd be good. That'd be all right. We'll try to we'll try to upload more every other month or whatever. <laughs> you better upload that and shorten it on TikTok or somewhere.